No. Oh yeah, yeah, you're right. Oh, I forgot about that. Put through my mind. No, no, it's still sneak. You're right. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. No, you don't. I know what I'm doing. Wait, it should be switched. For fuck's sake! Actually, I don't know. Who's what player? Thank goodness. Okay, no, it's it's right. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we're back. Grand finals. It's a run back with Mr. Fish and Sneak. We just saw them in winners final a moment ago. Um, so this gonna be a good match. You know, they're both, you know, probably warmed up. They just finished matches and uh, yeah, we're getting right into it. Game watch versus Mark. Oh yeah, Mr. Sting matchup. Don't see it very often. Yeah, but as soon as Mr. Fish switched to Marth last set, he definitely took control. I mean, I'm sorry, Mr. Game & Watch last set. Mr. Game & Watch. Mr. Whatever. Game & Watch. I don't care. Played by Mr. Fish. That would be going forever. I know. For days. And that's really impressive that he can uh, spot him. So spot it. Alright, so what we saw from uh, Mr. Fish last game was extensive combos. Uh, which netted him victory. We'll and extensive can, nine hammers as well. Extensive nine hammers, but the combos led into the nine hammers. We'll see if we can yeah, see that again. Sneak did some great edge guarding uh, with lots of pokes and good neutral game. Um, so let's see if we see more of that this match. Seeing the stellar oh, neutral game by Sneak again. That should have been a Dacus. Good. Sorry. <laughs> we're a little bit biased here. Yeah, we're uh, gonna stay unbiased. I'm sorry. Chris is our hometown hero. Yeah, nothing against Sneak, but we love seeing you know Louisiana Tech students win, so yeah. getting some more recognition. Anyway, and um, we we love him for coming here. Yeah, um, adds a little bit more recognition to our scene, honestly. Uh huh. We're all getting ready for WinterCon, so ooh, that was a nice, interesting try. Oh, oh wow, a nice job reset. Yeah, usually it's able to tech those. A lot more percent. Oh, oh, very good spike by Sneak. Edge guard again. <laughs> As Chris says, it was very neutral. Yeah. Even uh, Mr. Fish can appreciate. <laughs> it was very smooth, at least. So, um, Mr. Fish probably looking to close out the stock without taking too much damage, but, you know, of course, Sneak is going to try to not let that happen. He's a little bit above combo percent, so he's got to probably do something raw or slightly raw. Give him sushi. It's probably not bacon at this point. I can see a dank is coming in. Yeah. Uh oh, he's almost he's a full stock on already. There he goes. Right. Finished. Man, he did a lot getting that done. Twitter, give him watch his best moves. Comes up pretty quickly. Ooh, crop cancel the detail. Jump. Yeah, so oh much. my goodness. Just keep bringing him up. Very he wants so many jumps. I know. Or rather, things that you can act out of while going upwards. <laughs> But yeah, that was a very good combo to put right even, just right even with Sneak again. Right, both the percent. Oh yeah. Mr. Game Watch, lightest character in the game because he'll kill. Yeah. Actually, I'm not sure if he's Jiggly lightest Pump. in this game. I think he's a little bit heavier than Jiggly Pump. Ooh. Yeah. Looks like he needs to sweep there unless he already used it. I remember in Brawl, he was, he was, I think he was might have been tied with Jiggly Pump for lightest character. Ooh. We're even again, 0-0. Zero, zero. That was beautiful, uh... <laughs> The beautiful short up air wave dashes. So oh, Mr. Fish missed the tech. Now Sneak has an edge guarding opportunity. Sneak has a block guard. Another edge guarding opportunity. Oh, nice hell cancel. Uh, so, I'm actually not sure how good Mr. Game Watch's manhole is, but it's something he's played against this person a lot. Uh, and Mr. Game Watch, a decent amount. I think the manhole is one of the most frustrating moves. Big champ here for Sneak. Did not finish it off yet. Save your platform. Gave Mr. Fish the momentum. Alright, and he just wow. knocked him far enough off. <laughs> that platform really, <laughs> the platform really gave him a lot of help there. Alright. Game one, Mr. Fish. Lots of, uh, lots of aerial battles on the watch. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Fish going for the, uh, kind of pick my games. <laughs> Alright, both characters are choosing, the players are choosing to stay. My characters are going to head to Battlefield for match two. Yeah. I know it's talked about a lot, but Smash 4's lack of screen wiggling. Uh, that's, that's disappointing. That's it, disgusting. It is very disappointing. What was Sakurai thinking? 
I don't know, maybe he just thought it was a little bit too annoying. He wanted the casuals to not be, not be too vote when they Ooh, take a stick. Beautiful tipper. I mean, I'm I say casuals, I'm kind of casual myself. <laughs> Filthy casuals. 88, they were 88. It was great. No. Something, mate. Ooh. Wow, that down smash out of the down throw. Yeah. Good tipper. You don't watch his down throw. It's deadly if you don't tag it. It's an easy tag, but if you mess up, you know, you're in trouble. Nice and down. Ooh, nice. Sneak needs to find a way to get the stock before it's too late. He doesn't want to get a whole one behind. Yeah. 88% looking. Oh my goodness. Wow. Parachute. See, the thing about that parachute is it doesn't come out as quickly as you think it does. They're pressing the button a long time, so a long time before it actually comes out. It's so such a good hit. See it. Once it comes out, it's such a good box. Though. Yeah, but I mean, Whoa. these combos are going on for days. Wow, nice hit by Sneak. Trying to get his feet back on the ground here. Yeah, like I was saying, you may not see that parachute come out, but they they have committed to it a long time before you see it. Oh yes. So that's why I think a parachute kill is pretty impressive. Mm -hmm. Ooh, very good. Humpies for days. Yeah. Much pillars. Yeah, which is a fun character to watch. Uh oh, ring is ringing. He's going off. Sneak isn't letting that stop him though. Game watches. Miss fourth match. Oh, try to get a little fancy there. Let's see Amherst start coming out soon. Good forward smash. The tipper did not kill! Almost got another one. Trades. He's got a hedge guard in there. Ooh, and Mr. Fish gets back on the stage. The power shield, nonetheless. He's lost his jump. Alright, so he's crouching like a tiger. Yeah, right below that platform. Oh, he tried to read a tech roll. Uh, the camera kind of lagged. I don't know. <laughs> oh, he still has to jump the whole time. Considering that jump, I have a resource. Right, I will finally take life number two off of Mr. Game and watch. All right, seventy-four percent last stock. Let's see if Sneak can pull something out. Mr. Fit doesn't do something stupid. <laughs> he's taking some risks. He, he's known to do some stupid things. And that'll be game number two <laughs> going to Mr. Fish. Not saying those stupid things don't work. <laughs> Alright. I mean, Mango's also done to do stupid things. Yeah. And there's one time. But would you agree that a lot of genius is created by being stupid? <laughs> Read that off of like uh no I can't without myself right now. Well then yes, I fully agree. <laughs> I can hear where match three is going. Oh, undecided. Do they pick characters first? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't think you're supposed to do that. But I don't think this game. This is a bit like high level tournaments. Just for money. <laughs> Uh, unless Chris is goofing around, he's definitely gonna sit Game and Watch. Oh yeah, now they've characters. Um, Game and Watch is standing. I want to see Sheik. Hopefully that can uh, give Sneak a little bit you know, better chance his final destination. Let's see. Okay. I don't, I don't know if uh, Sheik has game grabs in Game and Watch. He's a little footy. I was floating in Well, she can chin grab Ness, who's floating as well. I mean, all he knows Ness stuff. Yeah. So, if she can chain grab Ness, probably game and watch too. I could be wrong. Yeah. This is saving his jumps and using it smartly to mm -hmm. get right out of reach. Ooh, that was almost a very hard beat down throw. That was a very good wow. jump. Wow. He is reading his text like a book. Yeah. Snake Shield is uh, running thin, but he's using it well. Yeah. Wow. Collision in there. Grab that ledge. Oh, Ooh, he let go a little too early. Should have rolled up. Yep. Yeah. 
that was an interesting up B. Putting him in sneaks got stage control, but the king comes down on top. And he just it away. probably didn't have a jumper. Thought he had a jump. Right. He gave a little uh, sign that it wasn't exactly what he wanted to happen. Exactly. Woohoo! That momentum. Fair. Wow. He not always safe on shield. If you don't have cancel it, as a second hit, uh, the splashes. So sometimes you can trick people in thinking that uh, you've come down and it's safe to shield grab, then there's another hit coming out. Damon Watch has the wonkiest hitboxes. Yeah. Like that chair hit again from behind. But that's a, a weird case where um, sometimes people say that you always want to cancel every move if you can. Game Watch's down air is one of those moves that has a hitbox when you hit the ground. You don't necessarily want to out cancel that. Wait, you don't get that hitbox if you out cancel? It comes out faster. Okay. I didn't know that. He's out of his job. And I think Sneak just saved him. Seems so, but that nair's gonna take it all. Goodness, not quite. Very good. Uh, fair. Come on off the ledge. It's so interesting that Chris is up being. When he's still in the blast zone, or when he's, he's, when he's still in the behind, magnifying glass, <laughs> and he's still making it back to stage. Yep, he knows his uh, distances very well. Yeah. And Grady still has the jump. Good fair coming out of shield. Wow. But uh, he racked up a lot of percentage before getting KO'd by the end watch. If uh, anyone viewing can tell, we are the best talkers ever. Talkers? Yeah. I think we're doing fine. <laughs> yeah. Alright, very good. I think he's got a pretty fair lead right now. Um, hopefully, you know, the invincibility's worn off. This is his chance to take a game. Oh! Oh my my! <laughs> God. Frosty. Yeah, that scuba Yo, Steve's coming in clutch. <laughs> the sneak right. is not done yet. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we go to the dash tag chain. So close. Oh man, Sneak is not giving up. <gasps> oh, oh he has a jump. So that's game three to Sneak. <laughs> Two one. Yeah, he did. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Two one, Mr. Fish's favor. <laughs> I am the you. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that on one of the computers in uh, Davison. Yeah, one of the teachers went to use a projector, and IMVU was saved to the desktop. Ooh. Yeah, it was interesting, to say the least. Well, I'm sure it was one of the students just trolling. Oh, totally. I mean, for real though, more than one teacher used that room. Oh, yeah. Anyway, we're off to an early start. Back to Town of Dreams. Last time we were on the stage was Game 5 of Frosty vs. Sneak. Sneak was really exciting. Yeah, Sneak could, took control of it. This is a very good Game & Watch stage, though, but Sneak must feel comfortable here if he picked it Game 5 last time. Yeah. Sneak's playing a pretty conventional sheet. Just down throws, nares, fares. <sighs> I'm not sure what else you can wow. do. Is there such thing as conventional Game & Watch? Um... <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think so. I don't think there are enough people for it to be established. We're back on a stage for free. I think uh, pillars would Good be actually established. Or uh, conventional game watch. Yeah. But I don't think Fish plays a conventional any character, honestly. They're all pretty wonky. His bases are sand. <laughs> wow! Oh, oh my! my! That percent just laying it on there. RN Jesus is on its side. Yeah, he would have gotten 9 if it was RN Jesus. Well, it's RN Jesus, not RN God. <laughs> I, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. The jokes. Um, I don't know what he just hit him with, but it was... Good, cool. fair. And, uh... The small side boss of the Cotton and Dream showing up. Oh, saving that jump for a rainy day. Comes in handy. 
down, tilt starting those combos. Oh my word, what? <laughs> what's going on? I don't even see it. <laughs> but they know what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure. Down. <laughs> Oh, wow, I was almost definitely close. expecting a down throw, I'm sure. Right, Sneak was too. Yeah, he saw the jump. Good. Damn. Oh my goodness. That down air combo so well. Miss. And Fish is chanting Mr. Right. Game Watch. As the crowd also chants for Mr. Game Watch. Sneak on his torment stock. Can you make a comeback like last game? Good jab reset. Jab, right on the percentage. <laughs> Mr. Game Watch drowns in the water. It's my dot is a jab set. Did you see the animation for uh Oh my god. Run away, dude. The end of the tournament. That's Mr. Fish. 3-1. Game Watch player is to be able to know what's going on above the scene.